asking her Let's to split, split the bill. It. You want me to pay half? Yeah, I think we should split it because that's You what, want me to pay half of this? Well, we're an equal couple, right? Do you see these nails? Yeah. Do you know how much they cost? They look like they were freed. This makeup? Uh huh. How much time it takes? How much does that cost? Uh, how much do uh, these earrings cost? Getting my hair done nice for you? How much do you think that costs? But You can pay for the chicken. I'm not doing it. Okay. Get your priorities straight. That doesn't seem fair. You're so entitled. This is probably satire, but this is the type of attitude some women have. They use their makeup expenses as a reason to force you to pay for the date. She's a classic entitled mean girl slut. Okay, so who's paying on the first date? Now, obviously I'm going to say it should be the man. And of course, there might be some people that don't agree. That's absolutely fine. Everybody has their own opinion. But here's my reasons why. I think there are a lot of feminists nowadays that are kind of like, no, we shouldn't let men pay. They're going to be in control to do what they want. and have. The it's not about control. It's, you know... Going back in history, it is it is in the male kind of persona to pay for the women on, on on first dates. It just is. And I think that's slowly dying and it's quite sad. Um, but I also think, you know, it's the man's job to be the provider and not saying necessarily five years down the line, he should still be paying for every single day. Of course, once the relationship, you know, blossoms and you kind of get to know each other, you know, you can you can, you can pay for dates now and again. However, it is it is the man's job. I mean, we put so much effort into getting ready for dates. We have our hair done, nails done. I mean, men just throw clothes on and, and rock out. Um, and I think any man that is well established and has the money wouldn't even question it. They'd get you a car to the date. Like they would they wouldn't even question it. I think the only people that are going to get triggered by this are broke guys and girls that think that they're not worth it. So therefore, they have to pay for a date. Um, because there's no reason, there's no reason why if someone's offering to pay, and and also I I also think from the first date if they want to go halves with you, what's it? That's a good insight to the rest of the relationship. Do you see what I mean? Like they're not gonna put in much effort. They're gonna expect you to pay half for everything, and you know I personally think that that the man should pay on the first date. I think you know if you're in a situation where they ask you to split it cover the whole bill, piss off and never see them again. Because <laughs> there's plenty of men that will. And, it, you know, I'm not saying you might not necessarily want a life where the man pays for everything for you, but certainly the first date, they should be putting in the effort and they should definitely be paying. She doesn't even know what she's saying. She's talking about it being back from history for guys to pay for the date and to be a part of the guy's personality. In history, the woman did not work. They stayed at home and took care of the children. Like usual, women want the benefits of traditional women while being modern women. She's not at all traditional. This is the story time of the worst date that I've been on in my entire life. Let's call this guy Edwin because that was his name. So Edwin and I had been on only two dates and we were talking for like less than like three weeks. He was a really nice guy like after our first date it was my birthday a week later and he gave me like champagne and roses just like randomly dropped them off at my apartment so i was like he's a vibe so edwin and i are planning our third date and he's like oh it's your turn to pamper me immediately i'm like what the fuck he's like this date's on you like you're gonna plan it you're gonna pay for it you're gonna do everything and i'm like because ah, 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 ah. i'd assume that's a fucking joke so i keep saying to him i'm like you're so funny you're so funny but i go ahead and i like book the date i just book when i'm like my favorite sushi spots and i'm like that's so he's like not gonna make me pay that'd be absolutely insane listen i would not mind paying for a date if i was in a relationship with somebody not when i'm going on the third fucking date and you're supposed to impress me to try and get in my pants so the whole week we're talking about this and he's like can't wait for your treat and now i'm starting to get fucking triggered because in my past relationships I was like the breadwinner, so I always paid for fucking everything, and I dated losers, so they expected me to pay for everything. So we get to the sushi restaurant, everything's going great, and then they're like, oh, what do you guys want to drink? Like the waiter's like, what do you guys want to drink? And he's like, ooh, I'm gonna get something fancy because Livy's paying today. What? So then I'm like, okay, Livy, time to be vulnerable. Let him know about your past. So I let him know, I'm like, hey, like, just so you know, this is really um, triggering me because 
I was used in my past relationships because I was the breadwinner. So this is like super triggering for me. And if it, this is like a joke to you, it's really not funny. He's like, I'm not kidding. And I'm like, what? He's still kidding. So the bill comes and he slides it my way. And he's like, here you go. Man, if you're watching, there's nothing that makes a woman drier in the entire world than you like literally sliding the bill towards her. Like that's pathetic. But I say, fuck it, you know what? If I'm gonna pay, I'm gonna pay like a baller. So I pull out like hundreds. She had all of that money when she pulled out those hundred dollar bills because she makes men pay for dates and it gives her plenty of opportunities to save her money while also making average guys go broke. Don't fall for it.